All right, let's do a 20 to 20,000 hertz test tone of this new build, and I'll show you what it can do. All right, 20 to 20,000 hertz test tone, pure sine wave. And the top red line is what this thing actually did, open air. And as you can look right down here, you got 10 hertz, and then you got 20. 30 starts making a little bit, and about 40, 10, 20, 30, 40 is when it starts to really jump up high. And at 50 hertz on up, look how smooth that is. All the way up to about 10,000 then it starts dropping off big time so there you have it numbers don't lie it's not really truly scientific but it's pretty good gives me a really good idea of what is going on with this build one of the smoothest sounding buttery sounding this is a sealed case I started off with a dual two inch base port design and I could not get the huff and chuff too much air turbulence going on inside this box so I just closed them off and made a cap for an on and off power switch here and a plate here is a steel for here. This is an 8 inch SCAR Audio dual voice coil woofer, custom steel grill, bed lined, and this is bed lined here too, both these. And these tweeters are PRV from Made in Brazil Silk Dome. Excellent freaking tweeters. You just screw them into place, drill a hole, screw them in, you're good to go. On top here, got a 3.5 millimeter audio jack and voltmeter for charging your phone. DC power jack down here. So you can plug in a 12 volt lithium battery charger. And then on the, I got a Bluetooth connection here. <clears throat> Let's look on the inside get this thing open and there we have it let me turn the light on here so we can see a little bit better I used a uh, silex stick on sound deadening material uh, 20 ohm resistor 100 watt for the tweeters to knock them down just a little bit they already come with a capacitor and of course this is a uh, dual voice coil woofer so you got right and left channel right here uh, VU lights, the battery is a 10 amp hour lithium battery right here encased, got a fuse, amplifier is a, what's this, Dalk Audio, it's rated for like 150 per channel, probably good for about like 75 to 80 watts per channel RMS good. And what I'm doing is I'm running it at 36 volts using a 12 volt to 36 volt step up booster. You know, you turn the switch on and off and it shuts just this and this off. So you get 36 full power going into this amplifier for full boogie. Banana plug speaker connections. And that's about it. it weighs about 22 pounds. There's the plate right there. I had to cap off that base port. I just could not get, there's just too much pressure inside here. And this is the IX series entry level subwoofer from Scar Audio, which produces plenty of midtones. And as you saw on the spectrum analysis right up here, I'm not losing any frequency at all. Look how flat that is. And this thing, it, it shows when you're listening to it, there is no gobbledygook, no weirdness along this plane right here. It's just really, really nice and flat. So there you have it. This, I, I love this build. I call it Booger because it's green. <laughs> Looks like snot. And uh, one of my favorite, it took a long time to get this thing situated and making sound, but this grill too was, there's no uh, slap on the grill. I used a eight inch O-ring embedded inside this steel grill. It's a DS 
18 grill that I just bedlined. You know, sweeters just screw, and I just cut a two inch hole and just screwed it in. And, you know, made sure everything was good and sealed. But it's one hell of a speaker. One hell of a great, smooth sounding acoustic suspension slash sealed unit. Just a really, really, I don't know how to describe it, detailed sound. Just really lifelike. And the bass goes down low enough where most people will dig it. It's not necessarily subwoofer low. It'll probably get a little bit lower if I had a port in there. But that's all right. It's smooth. That's what I like about it. See that right there? That's smooth. That is really, really smooth. Down into about 40, 45 hertz or so. That's where it starts making, it drops off. And there you have it. Pretty, pretty happy with this one. All right, you take care. And we'll see you next time. Just showing you some of my other builds down here. Later.